What's poppin' everybody? Welcome to another episode of The Meezy Show, okay? Now, I'm your host with the most, aka hostess with the mostest, since somebody got something slick to say, you hear me? Anyway, uh, before we begin, please hit that subscribe, that thumbs up, and that like button. Well, the thumbs up is the like, though. Hit that subscribe and that thumbs up button, man. I appreciate you. Please and thank you. Now, uh, BG, uh, I ain't gonna say he necessarily got together with Mozzie, but they did a... They're on a song together uh, So we're gonna go ahead and react to that So for those that don't know BG did like a whole bunch of years in prison Something like Nine years I don't even remember how many years Nine or some crazy number He was in the feds He got in trouble in uh, Detroit For you know Doing what he was doing So Anyway He's been going kind of crazy He's been getting together with uh, With Kevin Gates And a lot of different artists lately uh, A lot of different artists So anyway He's getting ready to do do his for sure do his his thing. So he's just trying to get his relationships probably back, get his bag up, <clears throat> get his name back out there. He's he's a well known dude, man. Like maybe for the young kids out here, they, they don't know who he is, but trust me, when you from the eighties and nineties, that BG was that guy, bro. Like he was a no, well known name. But anyway, here goes the audio. Uh, let's go ahead and take a listen. Okay, so here we go. Ready? This for these niggas that be all that mouth, all that mouth, all that yapping, all that yapping, all that talking, all that talking. These niggas be all walking, nobody, nobody heard me. Stunt I swear to see where I'm stunt. from, we hustle to make a living from robbing, serving, whatever you name it. Then Jizzle did it, whatever bringing the cheddar, I'm with it. I gotta get it. Go out of the Ten Commandments, I'm still asking for guilt. I'm on the block when it's bumping and when it's slow, when it's raining or sunny, bringing keys to Detroit in the snow. Hollin' what's handin' water, they hollin' what up, those and bows. 1300, them blocks, 24 bad. I ain't no rookie in the game, I'm a pro. Soon as I jumped off the porch, Pee Wee showed me how it go. That was in 92. See, by 94, I was cooking, cutting, and weighing on the grind, getting no hustle. Man, all my life, I'ma be a street nigga. As long as I'm in the game, I'm playing for keeps, nigga. I catch a nigga playing, I'm bringing that heat, nigga. Most of these niggas be stunting, they don't want beef, nigga. Game banging, trenches is my safe haven. Call us for the altercation and he came yanking. 33rd running the fourth, so that's the same payment. You know my shooters paid for, niggas making payments. You trying to meet your dead homies? We can make arrangements. As suit and tie come in your side, he guys to make you famous. I'm staying dangerous, I'm a gangster, I be on alert. The pills and powder ain't no problem, I be on the sun. Don't ask me about no nother nigga, I don't know them nerves Don't, know them don't ask me about no bitch, you fucking it, who all fucked the first Bevel beast till I'm deceased, that's a gift and a curse I Ain't pulling dick for this position, that's, that's being a, a real nerd Nowadays I try to leave them and be cool But these puppets be tripping straight, disrespecting the rules And they know I'm a dog with my hand on a tool I don't know why they shoot me, still test the dude But I know what I'ma do, since I got too much to lose In my shop of city boys, they tweaking the egg of food Tweaking the grab of chop Tweaking the cut them loose Tweaking the lead is set full of bodies without a clue Tweaking the hair your family creep is making the food Tweaking the tell you that there was a long view I ain't the one to be fucking with But if you buy one day, I'm the one you should try to pull up And get this money with I'm on some other shit But if you cross my line I turn back to hit fucking quick And spit a nigga shit I better piss out a nigga with these bullets Like I better piss out a bitch Gang bang it Trenches is my safe haven. Call us for the altercation and he came yanking. 33rd running the fourth, so that's the same payment. You know my shooters paid for, niggas making payments. You try to meet your dead homies, okay, we can so make arrangements. Like As suit and tie come in your side, he has to make you like famous. I'm staying dangerous, I'm a gangster, I be on alert. The pills and powder ain't no problem, I be on the side. Don't ask me about no nother nigga, I don't know them nerves. Don't, don't ask me about no bitch, you fucking it, who all fucked the first? Bevel beast till I'm deceased, that's a gift and a curse. I ain't pulling dick for this position, being a real one works. This for these niggas that be all that mouth, all that mouth, all that yapping, all that yapping, all that talking, all that talking. These niggas be all fucking up. So look, <coughs> excuse me, so look. Just a little feedback on my end, right? I'm sure everybody else has their own opinion. Uh, one thing I really like about BG, never, ever, ever did he try to uh, assimilate a different style that's not his, right? Now, you see this quite often with artists, especially as they get older, they get a little dated. 
they got to figure it out. They got to, oh, damn, what am I going to do? You know what I'm saying? They don't want to be that, you know what I'm saying, the 40-year-old rapper, you know, that's singing or rapping something that's a style that doesn't, it's not accepted, that's dated. One thing I like about BG, he he's always had that same, uh, the trench be my safe, hey, you know how he be, you know what I'm saying? He always had that same, like, flow all the time. Uh, you know, uh, like, never have I heard him have a different sound. And that's what I like about him. He's not like, and I'm not trying to, like, disrespect no other artists or anything like that. But I see it a lot amongst the older guys that are, you know, primarily, like, 40 and up. They get to try to, like, do the auto tone and all. Like, that's not even your generation. Like, it's cool to embrace the youngsters. and But... He's not doing that. He sticks to BG. He sticks to the, that Chopper City sound, that 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 Life After Cash Money. By the way, Life After Cash Money is hard. That's a hella hard city. I want it. You got it. Don't make me take it out of your pocket. That's hard. Anyway, uh, yeah, so bam. So, number one, that's what I like about not only BG, but that song. He always delivers that same sound. My personal opinion, I think verse one was his hardest verse verse two it was like cool whatever but it was kind of like what it, you know but the the beef the the, the beat and then mozzie kind of picked up on that uh so yeah verse one was hard in 92 and 94 in detroit in the snow and all that that was hard you know what i'm saying and he's speaking all facts you know what i'm saying he was out there pushing that boogaloo and that's what got him sent to the feds right it was pushing that boogaloo out there in um in michigan detroit michigan uh, which I don't know if that's something Birdman want to talk about because th that's why he was doing it. His money wasn't, you feel me? Birdman had, a, you know, well, everybody that knows knows. So anyway, with that being the case, right, he ended up catching federal case, bam, he went out of there. So, moving forward, right? Uh, okay, so verse one was hard. Verse two, it was kind of like, well, it was cool. I feel like he could have did a little bit better job, but at the same time, I don't know, maybe it was like a last minute, quick little bam, bam, you know what I mean? Now, Mozzie's hook, the, the hook on, that Mozzie hit was hard. It was cool. Uh, gang banging in the trenches in my safe haven, something, something. So that's hard. He always got the usual raspy voice and uses certain words that not everybody use that makes him unique or whatever. Uh, so, yeah, I like that. I like the hook. Um, and when he mentioned Pebble Beach, that's a place in, uh, I don't know, somewhere in Sacramento because they keep mentioning the uh, uh, Sibo, when he dissed him, he said he even did a walk up on Pebble Beach. Go on, ask him or something like that. So, Pebble Beach is a known place in Sacramento. So, I personally think that was cool. If I had to rate the song um, with the hook, both verses, as well as uh, the hook, both verses, as well as the beat, I'd probably give it like a solid, like. I'd probably say like a solid, like. Seven to eight, maybe. I say eight just because I like BG, but the song itself, like, I maybe that the verse two wasn't didn't really do it for me. You know what I'm saying? Um, verse one was fire. Verse two, whatever. Mozzie kind of picked up the slack a little bit, and the beat made up for it. So I say I'll give it like seven point five to eight. We'll just do like that, just because I like BG. But anyway, let me know what you think. How would you rate it? What do you think about BG? What do you think about his new resurgence? What do you think about him collabing with Mozzie, Kevin Gates, all these people that you're seeing him collab with? Let me know. Tell me in the comments. I appreciate you guys watching. Thanks for viewing this video. Salute. If you haven't already, please subscribe. Y'all have a good evening. I'm gone.